doing a show. I mean, you, you've got seven or eight writers, the writer's room. The showrunner is basically the CEO. You do 23 episodes. They're multi-million dollar each week with a large staff to, to keep track of, to keep all the creative going, everything else. Just describe what it's like doing your job day in and day out. Well, I'll tell you, the secret is you don't think about it. It's kind of like your Wile E. Coyote. You're fine in the middle of the cavern, the canyon, as long as you don't look down and realize that you're not standing on anything. Um, so the question scares me because it sort of requires me to actually look at what I do and pay attention to it and look down and see that I'm actually standing in the middle of nothing. But, um, you know, I, my, the general, you know, way we produce a show, it's, it's a real, it's just a step-by-step -step process. Um, and it's kind of like the old saying, how do you eat an elephant one bite at a time? So we don't think about it in terms of 23 episodes of television, and then we don't think of each individual episode as, you know, 50 to 70 uh, scenes or, you know, 48 to 56 pages. We think about it as one moment at a time, and you, you slowly build it brick by brick. Um, I guess, you know, the the question of sort of how you do it it's it we could be here all night i i probably the simplest way to express it is we we first start off with just what's the story we want to tell this particular week um usually the answer to that question uh, come is a function of two things. It's a function of what did we do last week? You know, where are the characters at in their various emotional journeys? What are they reacting to that happened to them in the previous episode? Uh, as well as where are we headed? You know, not just where we've been, but where do we know we're going? Because at the beginning of every season, we arc out the broad strokes of the season. Um, and I always describe uh, a... Um, designing a season of television, we, we design a season of television the way I like to go to Europe. You know, I like, I like to have my tour guide booked and I like to have my, you know, restaurant reservations and I like to have my museum tickets, but at the same time, if I hear about this amazing cafe, I want the freedom to go to the amazing cafe. I don't want to just be beholden to my itinerary. And that's kind of what we do with the shows is we, we have a plan, but we also allow ourselves to be inspired and come up with new ideas. Um, but basically we're we're slowly drilling down towards the process of okay we know we where we want to go how do we get there scene by scene by scene by scene